Last time we learned that Mr. Spiky eats coral. Today we learn how Mr. Spiky is part of a food web. A food web is a web showing who eats what. Tropic levels are links in the food web. Mr. Spiky is a lower carnivore, and that means it only eats other animals. Now we are off to the aquarium to see parts of the Harlequin Shrimp Food Web, food web in action. Green seagrass is a producer and the sea urchin eats it. Other information, it's at the bottom of the food web. Grandma, okay, so what are those things coming out of here? Oh, that's the cup of the corporate is a cold. And the sea urchin and Mr. Spiky takes it. Other information, Mr. Spiky is better than a sea urchin. That's one way to grow coral. Sea are often omnivores. They eat plants and animals. A favorite food of sea urchins is grass. There's green sea grass. The bubbly white glistening thing? Oh, those are algae. Those are called bubble algae. Cool. Oh, look, there's a little urchin in there. Oh, we never I see it. When we were looking <laughs> for all the urchins. Get it? Because you said, because you. We already know that Mr. Spiky eats Acropora coral. It finds Acropora coral by crawling around on his tube feet and searching for food. We also know that the Harlequin shrimp eats Mr. Spiky. It survives by using its spikes for protection. If he gets damaged, he can regrow his arms. Similar species, but yeah, it's very big.